Hello and welcome back. Today we take a look at two highly competitive East African countries, Tanzania against Uganda. Now, to start with, both countries have their own strengths, but you know what we do here. We put the facts right. These two African countries are a hard tie to break. Is it Yoweri Museveni or is it Samia Salulu Hassan? Who and why? Let's dive right in. Welcome to the Unravel Zone where we provide and compare real facts. We place the bulls head to head. Please take a second to like and subscribe. It'll go a long way in supporting our work to bring you even more interesting African information. As I said, today's tie is a hard one and so we will put the facts of both countries to the table and see at the end who takes the lead. First, we take a look at military and firepower. Uganda is ranked 83 out of 145 in the latest military rankings while Tanzania is ranked at 101 out of 145. Uganda has a total 58,500 military personnel with 47,000 being active while Tanzania has 67,000 military personnel but with only 26,000 of them being active. Still on the same topic, Uganda has a total of 50 aircrafts while Tanzania has a total of 40 aircrafts. Next, we compare the GDPs of both countries. This is a parameter we cannot afford to miss when comparing the two countries. Uganda's GDP as at the end of 2022 was at $109 billion while Tanzania's GDP as at the end of 2022 was at $167 billion. A hard tie to break, right? Next, we take a look at a simple yet necessary topic, the export capacities and capabilities of the two countries. For 2021 Uganda's exports were $6.71 billion with coffee being the major export product. Tanzania on the other hand saw an export of $9.72 billion which was an increase of 9% from the previous year. On to the next topic. As usual, there's always strength in numbers, right? We take a look at the populations of the two countries. Uganda has a total of 46.2 million people while Tanzania has a total of 63.8 million people. This leads us to the next topic which is the labor force of each country. From the population we mentioned Uganda has a labor force of averagely 16 million people while Tanzania has a labor force of 25 million people. Onto the defense budget of the two countries, Uganda totaled to $934.2 million while Tanzania is at $748.9 million. Finally, Uganda has a total of 47 airports with a total road coverage of 20,544 kilometers while its counterpart has a total of 167 airports with a road coverage of 87,581 kilometers. The few topics we have looked at certainly give a perfect base for us to pick the better one. Of course, both countries have their strengths and weakness, but who do you think dominates the other? See you in the next video.